Yo, today we're gonna to be making lilies out of paper and pipe cleaners, and we'll show you what you're gonna need for this project, okay? Okay, paper. Yes. Tape. Yeah. Scissors, pipe cleaners, and a pencil. Yes, that's all the stuff that you're gonna need for this project. And so we're gonna first start with the white piece of paper, and so we'll move everything off to the side. And we're gonna make our lilies out of your handprint, okay? Can you put your hand down here? Good job. Way to go, Ads. And then we're gonna have you spread your fingers out. There you go. And then I'm gonna trace around your fingers. Does that tickle? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Uh-oh, I kind of made your fingers big. <laughs> Look at my fingers. <laughs> and then at the bottom of your handprint, we're gonna close it off with a curved line like that. Okay, let's do one more since you're gonna make a flower and then I'm gonna make a flower. All right, there you go, and then spread them out, and then we'll trace it, trace your fingers one more time. There we go. Four, five. Yeah, and then we're gonna close off the bottom again. Mm -hmm. Okay, now the next step is I'm, we're gonna cut this out. Okay. Okay? Good job, heads, we did it. We got your hands all cut out. Good job on your cutting. Okay, next step is we're gonna use our tape and I'm gonna go ahead and cut uh, or rip off two pieces. Can you hold both of them? Yeah. All right, and this part you may need, uh, if, if you're at home it, and you're trying to do this by yourself, you may need a little help from an adult for this part because rolling your handprint is a little tricky. But we're gonna roll it so that the handprint makes a cone shape. So what I mean by that is at this end, it kind of comes to a point. See how the hole's uh, small? And then up at the top, it, it gets a little bit bigger. So you want to put a piece of tape right there at the base of the flower. Okay. Cool. And then wrap it around. Good job. That was awesome. Job on taping. <laughs> All right. Now let's roll this one. And we'll tape this one also. Okay. Those are a little tricky for you to do this by yourself, huh? Mm -hmm. we, we tried this before the video yeah. and you needed some help. So go ahead and tape that. Good. Oh, yes. Good job. Sorry, I almost let go of it. All right, okay. Now the next step is we're going to curl the little uh, petals for our flower. So we're going to take a pencil and why don't you use this pencil? Okay. And what we do is we put it right here on the first petal and roll the petal or the finger down the pencil like this. You gotta kinda hang on to it, and then when you let go, it'll be curled. Okay. There you go, good job. You did it, yes. And then we're gonna do that on each petal. Okay. So when we're all finished, each of the petals should look curled. Mm -hmm. All right, okay, now we can set our, our flower down and we're gonna get our yellow uh, pipe cleaner and we're gonna fold it in half and we're gonna split this so you have one side and I have the other you can just use scissors to cut it so I'll give you that one now we're gonna take the yellow pipe cleaner and fold it in half again so it should make a V then we're gonna take the top and we'll fold we'll fold a little piece down like this all the way down and pinch it we'll do that on both sides Fold it down, pinch it. This is gonna be the, the inside of the flower. Okay. And you do have to be careful of the end because sometimes they're a little pokey. You got it? Yeah. <laughs> then we're gonna take the end that we folded and just bend it down halfway, not all the way. Good. <laughs> Good job, Kate. Okay, now we're going to get our green pipe cleaner, and this is going to be our stem. And we're going to take uh, the yellow, like this, and we're going to wrap the green stem around town. Around town. <laughs> and then with the extra, you can just kind of bunch it up if you want so there's a little knot at the end. Okay. Good job. Yes. 
squish it and then pinch it so that it will stay there. There. Good job. Let me see. Yeah, we pinch that. We can pinch that even more. There we go. Okay. Now we can kind of pull the pull it apart just a little bit so it's not stuck together like that. Pull it just apart. Okay. Now we're gonna get our flowers and we're gonna take the bottom of our of our part, pipe cleaner for the stem and take that down the middle of our flower and then pull it through so that the yellow part is down inside the flower. And you don't have to pull it all the way down. You just pull it so you can still see it. Good, we did it. That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. <laughs> and it's super easy. Mm -hmm. And the cool thing about this is you can make a bunch of these. If you have a lot of pipe cleaners, you can make a lot of these and then you can put them in a vase. Check it out. We made these before, didn't we? Yes. Should we put it in the vase? Nice. That's very pretty, huh? Yes. Yeah. We even have Mrs. Hubs help us decorate the vase. <laughs> we hope you guys had a lot of fun making your lilies with us. Remember to give your flowers to somebody you really care about. Should we give them to mom? Yes. Yeah, I bet she'll love it. <laughs> See you later, our friends. Goodbye. Bye. Oh, it smells like paper. <laughs>